Welcome back, everybody. Some pretty exciting news for anybody who happens to be in the know on War Thunder. They recently announced that the A10 Thunderbolt 2 would be coming to the game. The dev server went live shortly thereafter, and I've gotten to play it. If you are somehow not aware, being a subscriber of this channel, the A-10 is one of my favorite aircraft ever. Be sure to check out my full throttle review of it, or any of my numerous shorts about it when you're bored sometime. The A-10 will be interesting in War Thunder because it has a tremendously huge cannon and it's built solely for close air support and tank busting. So it seems like it's gonna fit right in with War Thunder's gameplay. We'll see. All right, here it is. Like the camouflage, this is the A-10A for uh, any DCS players concerned. Let's see, we've got uh, armor, pilot armor, of course, 32 millimeters, the old titanium bathtub. Oh, looks like we've got a little bit of armor, bulletproof glass right in the front. 44 millimeter, all right. It's not bad. How about the x-ray? Yeah, there's the gun. <laughs> Gow 8. I proposed, uh, if you didn't see my full throttle review of Santa's sleigh, I proposed using a Gow 8 to uh, deliver presents. Check that out if you're curious sometimes. Let's see, our fuel tanks. The wing spars. Oh, interesting. They've got the wing spar divided up. This thing will definitely fly with only half a wing. The way they've set up this wing spar. Yeah. Yeah, that's gonna work nice. Let's see what kind of secondary weapons we have here. Oh goodness, multi-purpose. Mark 84, GBU-8, 2,000 pounder. Six, six bombs, 12,000 pounds right there. GBU-8s, 500 pounders. Boy, look at all those. Look at all those Mighty Mouse rockets, look at those! <laughs> That's gonna be a good time. 20 millimeter cannons, why Why would you even... What? What? <laughs> what? They're accepting pre-orders for it, I, I think that the... The orders were... I think, I think it's 60 bucks. I was surprised that it wasn't more than that, actually. I'll talk more about that in a bit. But at least the way they've got it in here right now is it's gonna be a, a pack aircraft that you just have to buy. And they do, you know, they, they couch this as an early A-10, which it is, it's an A-10A, so, you know, you got that. Pretty slick looking aircraft, if I don't mind saying so myself, as a completely, completely unbiased person here. How's the, uh, interior model? Ooh! You, know, you wanna close that canopy, there you go. Does he, uh, oh yeah! I'm applying rudder there, and his feet are actually moving, that's pretty cool. It's like a little bit of wind up with the, yeah, it's, it's even got the rotation. I think we're gonna escort 49er here. Oh yeah. Yeah, they got nice air brakes, you are correct. Whoop. Make 15s, we got all sorts of people out here. There we go, go get them. Ooh! Oh, just AI. That's alright, not too bad with this sort of bomb loadout, you know? Let's see what we can do to bring some pain here. Looks like we got a bunch of vehicles. Coming straight down the road at us. Safe to say we will be able to render the road no longer operable. Ooh, yeah, we got rockets here too. Okay. Let's see what we can do with some bombs here first though. And bomb out. Yeah. Not as much as I would have liked, but we did some good things. Well, we did some things anyway. All right, we gotta bring it back around. Now we roll in on this group. Okay. 
<laughs> pretty good. Pretty good sound effect right there. Oh, we got a hit. Oh, just the kill assist. Dang it. That's all right. Now we roll out right back into this group. Hi, hello there. Is that the MiG-15? I think we still got some rockets here. Let's see. Yeah. Ooh, oh boy, uh, we're flying. We're coming back around. Oh. <laughs> All right, okay. Oof. Oh, wow. I have spotted a bridge. It's only one thing that I know how to do with bridges. This one's gonna be snug, but I think we might make it. Uh, oh yeah, 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 no problem. Microsoft Flight Simulator, did you see that? Everybody else can do it. I've got my little rocket trajectory thing here on. All right. We got one rocket left. We somehow managed to hurt almost nobody right there. That is incredible. All right. Get a little bit, a little bit overzealous with my, uh, turning sometimes, which is fine. Not quite as nice of a sight picture as I would like, but it will work. There we go. Their anti-air cover is gone. Whoo, all right. We got an aircraft destroyed? I don't, I don't know about that. Two minutes of fuel left. We flew all the way out here. We're gonna run out of gas. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense. <laughs> that was a lengthy flight. Bradley. We go. Still have one guided ro guided missile, but not even probably going to use it. Come on now, get your nose down there. There you go. Well, maybe. Cannons are out of ammo. Will it still spin? Nope. All right, well, that wasn't too bad. I mean, we definitely put some hurt on them. All right, there we go, air break out. Dumb bombs. <laughs> that was a very satisfying plunk, plunk, plunk of bombs right there. Excuse me, was someone just... Are you actually... In a Kika, huh? Well, you know what? I suspect that the Kika is weak to 30 millimeter freedom. Alright. I thought that was a player initially. Oh, here's another one. Oh, I thought we had him. Whoops. 
Got off of got off a of home row there for a second. Oh, oh! <laughs> I wasn't even wasn't even trying to get that one. You know the the Gaway the business end of the Gaway just attracts enemies. It's crazy. And and. Oh, oh man, we got half the wing blown off right there. This thing is good at removing wings. What do we still have? We still got three 2,000 pound hits of regret right here. Let's see, all right, air break out. We gotta get, get slower so we can get the nose over. All right, only one out of that. I got three kills with the light bombs. Three three bombs, three kills with the 500 pounders, but the, the three 2,000 pounders, I only, <laughs> only managed one kill. AR-234, I think it's 30 millimeter proof. Gonna run out of ammo here pretty soon. I don't even know what happened. Oh, wow. We're fine. Suffrage damage of the right wing. You going down? No? That didn't even that didn't even appear to damage the plane at all. Hang on. To what ridiculous extent can we take this? <laughs> oh. Oh boy, oh no, oh, oh, oh. All right, once again, not a lot of damage. Classic A-10, <laughs> survived the ramming. We're up to two at this point. If the A-10 doesn't kill it with its gun, it's gonna kill it with its body. Let's see if we can just knife edge through it, you know? Oh man, all right. That's okay. Oh, there's a single hit. We'll just soften it up a little. Oh, geez. All right. I didn't even... That one wasn't even intentional. That one... Hey. Oh, really? Jack? Sure would be a shame. Oh. Yeah, when that thing connects, you can just arc some rounds out there, too. So, I'll tell you, the, uh... The bullet drop-off in this <laughs> is nothing like the bullet drop-off in DCS, which is great. I mean, just, you know, for anybody who's familiar with both, I'm not, I'm not complaining, I'm just observing. The, uh, the, the bullet drop-off that you would expect in DCS would be something like that, uh, that secondary cross. Secondary targeting reticle, rather. By the way, how many heckin' rounds do I have here? This is ridiculous. I mean, I'm excited about it. Make no mistake. I thought that I had it set up so that it would show my... Oh, boy. Youch. All right. All right. What are we up to now? Four, four tanks and four planes? I still got two missiles. Is this guy just gonna keep looping? I'm just gonna keep looping until I blow something off of your plane, huh? All right, well, if that's what it takes. Oh, oh, <laughs> yeah, something, something got blown off of his plane. You can definitely outclimb me in this sort of situation, but you're not gonna outclimb my bullets. Oh, all right. No active players left on the hostile team. We win. We win. All oh, yeah, there were two of us. There were two. 
Oh, goodness. This is just the dev server build now, so maybe things will change a little bit before the full release, but either way, I'm looking forward to this. I'll probably be streaming the dev server over on Twitch at some point soon, so be sure to connect with me over there if you haven't yet. You can also subscribe to the Nodak Express Long Plays channel where I will upload those streams later if you want to see some longer gameplay of just using the A10 on the dev server. This was a lot of fun, I'm looking forward to this. Thanks for watching!